Hello comrades and friends, and welcome to another episode of Grixis Grind. Surprise, surprise, Galois Field of the Dead. We had the um, results back of the deck lists from the Mythic Invitational, and if you add the Golo the Bant Golos, Four Color Golos, and uh, Golos Fires decks, that's 42.7% uh, of the meta. That is extreme. Of course, this is only the championship, so it's only the best decks that will be played there. Otherwise, the next most played was um, Oko decks, as 28% of the decks that were there were dedicated Oko decks. So together, that makes a staggering 70.7% of the meta game. 70.7% of the Mythic Championship meta game is comprised of two deck archetypes: Golos and Oko. So, with the ban announcement coming on the 29th, I really hope both of those decks leave, because it's really, really stale to have almost every deck, so pretty much every second deck is going to be Golos, and uh, you'll probably only see a non-Golos or non-Oko uh, deck one, every, one out of every 40, 4 games, which if you play like I do, will probably be about, you know, maybe three games a day or so. I don't know, I, I spend a lot of time on Ranked, right? Um, and today, in all my hours playing, I went up against one deck that wasn't Golos or Oko, and that was this very strange band control list that lost. Um, Otherwise, all of them were against either Golos or Oko, and if it was Oko, I believe it was only one of the matches was against uh, Oko. Otherwise, it was Golos and Golos and Golos, and even more Golos, and to surprise everyone there, they switched it up a bit and played Golos. Either way, we still need to climb 9 positions, which we can feasibly do by the end of the season. We just need to be climbing at plus 1 every day for 9 days. And there's 12 days left in the season. And so hopefully we can average that. Uh, unfortunately today I've played for many hours, and I've ended up right back where I started, so I've decided that I'm going to take a break for the night and get back to it tomorrow. Anyway, uh, I really enjoy one of these matches, uh, which I believe is going to be the one that I'll be putting in, and it's against a, surprise surprise, Golos Field of the Dead deck. And it really shows off just how good Sarkhan can be, and I'm really excited to show you that one. So I hope you enjoy it. Thank you very much for watching my videos so far. If this is your first time here, then welcome to the channel. I grind this Grixis Fires of Invention deck daily, and otherwise, thanks very much for watching. Good luck in your ranked games, and I'll see you tomorrow. Well, we can play that Fires on turn 4, so it's not a bad hand, at all things considered.
Sultai. Okay. Sorry, uh. Uh. Field of the Dead. Yeah. That one. One that everyone's playing. That bedazzle will be nice to get rid of it, though. I mean, it's the reason why we run it in the deck. I think they'll crack that. They shouldn't. Okay. Oh, uh, maybe they have a Securitas Rotten Hand. That's why they did it. That makes sense. So they'll have uh, seven mana to play with on turn five. All right, so fires into photo rays will be pretty nice. Double Golos and a Crisis. Well, that's not good. Um, don't really need another. I need to find a 5 mana play that can deal with what they're about to play. So hopefully... Uh, so they should get Golos. I was gonna say they should get play Golos first, get the Field of the Dead, then play. Oh no, they would have been two. Never mind. I'm not smart. Uh, we'll play the Castle Vantress, so then we can scry. But otherwise, we're pretty screwed. So we need to find Board Wipe and Liliana. So we'll have to board wipe and then kill Golos somehow. Ah, oh, no. Can't do that. That's rude. I'm gonna minus to get rid of my fires. It's the smart thing to do. I guess attacks first. Ah, getting more filled with the dead. That's interesting. Ouch. Fray of Wishes can get us a Legion's End. Just in case we find something a little bit better. No. Alright, so we're gonna have to get the Legion's End. Actually, we don't have to get Legion's End. We can get a, um, uh, Kaiser off. Slight bit better here. Alright, we need to get something good there. So that's a lot of zombies that I don't really like dealing with. Oof. 
I've got time. I do not have time. And we can Liliana. In exchange, we can minus minus. I require servants. Your course will volunteer from battle to the grave. It's a poor usage of Polis. But it keeps Liliana alive. I really don't like it though. Try this. Okay. That's better. If they have something like a circuitous route, this might make them want to use it. No more games. Indeed. So their stuff isn't a castle ventress because they can't activate it. We can let us write it, so well, so we can like deal with it somewhat. Because they can do both the adventure and the oh, great, more field of the dead. Thanks, I hate it. Fairy and bounce my zombie to kill my Liliana. This isn't a fight you can win. It really isn't. I'll protect you. That's I don't agree with that. Like a 
fun new toy. So that's 20 damage and we can block a grand total of 6 of it and then we heal up to <laughs> this deck is so fun! That's a big way. You have lethal, just swing in with all. Why wouldn't they end the game? We are very low on land, but turn one thought ratio. Like, we have a really solid curve if we can curve out. And we do still have 24 lands in the deck, plus we get the surveil from thought ratio. It's so risky. But we're already a game down. And we're versing Guild of the Dead, so... Oh, that Lord Asia should also help us get through to land. Uh, none of that. Awesome. Then we'll get rid of the... Negate, I guess. like to get more black mana, but I'm not going to say no to mana, because we could still draw a um, Fires of Invention, even though our Nasset's probably going to get counted here. Okay, Nasset's not going to be counted here. And she does shut down that Praesis quite nicely. So all in all, not bad. Ooh, 
that's that's perfect for us, girl. So they can't really like they could play the crisis, but if they do, then they don't have negate open. Now they can have both. They can have their cake and eat it. Yeah, thinking hard. choose to counter it, but we have the other one. We are at the mercy of their draws though. But they are also at the mercy of their own draws. If they top deck to crisis, that's gonna be... I mean, that's still really bad. Let's get Sarka on, I guess. So we can Sarka on Bolus and then they can't attack in. If we draw a land. The magical question. Do we draw a land? Sarkhan, you're beautiful. Everything is power, and I am everything. Ah, oh, did they not realize? Wow. Sakan. Oh, what a boy. Uh, no change to sideboard. Oh my lord, that was hilarious. may seem really strange, but Ashio really shuts them down. Super hard. Alright, we 
they have to hope they don't have a negate open though. Please no negate! Ah oh, shit. Please, 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 no negate. Come on, fucker. Yeah, oh, damn it. Well, there goes our game plan. Yep. But it won't get stuck on a bolus. Um, I'm gonna grab Ashiok. So we can always fab wishes again for the Sarkon. be able to do both Fey and Ashira. Double Field of the Dead? Oh, it was only one. Okay. I got excited for nothing, but... One Field of the Dead is still good! Okay, and we can bring back our Fae. Um, so we could play Sokka, maybe... I suppose it depends what they do. Destroy our fires. I don't really want to discard the fact the uh, ritual of soot now. Well, that's nice.
Oh, we get rid of an agent of treachery. That's nice. That's quite good. We not, might not play this DM event, so we have something to discard with the Fae. Chandra? Polis. That's fine. Get rid of the steam vents, I guess. So we can fair bushes get held a spell. Which I do like. Alright. Do we have the mana for it? Because it's four. So no, we don't have the mana for it right now. Six, eight, ten, and level twelve, so they can get the angels as well. I might bedazzle. We need to have a block of the Chandra. Okay. So they still get the big boy finale. But we have a ritual of soot. Sorry, Fay of Wishes, but you will die. Why are we still here? Just to suffer. No pressure. Every night, I can feel my leg. I'm known for my excellent fight. It is some pretty good timing. I am not making this up as I go. 
That is a really good card to pick. That was amazing. The immortal Nicole Bolas will be your end. That's a really good top deck there. I've got it. So I have three mana left. What do I ever want to get for three? Maybe a Elder Spell. Could get Sarkhan and just have it for the next turn. I think that's probably the best thing to do. And I will. I have the plus two with Chandra. Oh, looks like someone's getting a little steady. I can afford to plus one with Bolus and play the Fey. So I want to draw cards. Because I can't bounce the bay yet. Mr. President, I think we got him. Two bottom. So you would have swung in for eight and then stacked up two more tokens. So yeah, we had them. Oh, that's nice. Yet despite all that struggling, we are right back to where we started when this video began. Well, I think we have all learnt a lesson in futility. So thank you very much for watching. Good luck in your ranked games, and I hope you have a really nice day.